Hello and welcome to my Multi-MC tutorial. In this video, we will be covering how to add your own icons. Multi-MC has some icons that already comes with it, these right here, but we can actually add our own. So let's check it out. All right, so before we continue, I just want to mention that the Multi-MC playlist is down below in the description. If you don't know what Multi-MC is, how to install it, how to set up these instances and everything else, I've done a bunch of other videos on that. Check it out down in the playlist below. But anyways, we can actually add our own icons. And I'm sorry if you there's background noise, it's construction. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, um, you have the choice when making an instance, video down below in the, in the playlist, um, to change the icon of that specific instance. And here we can see that the FTP Skyblock Odyssey mod pack uh, actually imported its own icon, so that is really cool. But we can actually add our own, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, let's change this one, 1.16.2. I want to change that icon to my custom one. Say you can either make your completely own, um, but I have a few examples already downloaded. So I all I have to do is click add icon. I can also open the folder with the icons and you can put your icons in there. But what is easier is just clicking add icon and then I need to go to my downloads folder. And then I have just some examples here. So I have a Minecraft diamond, sorry, netherite sword and boom, there it is. It's a PNG with a transparent background. And there we go, the fabric is now a uh, netherite sword. That matches perfectly because it matches 1.16.2. Awesome. So that is how easy it is. And if you now make another instance and you add one that sword, there, there it is. You can go ahead and just do it. And as you can see, if we open the folder, it has added that sword.png. So you can, you can just put a bunch of your icons in here if you want them available. Now, just to give another example, I have not tried this before, so this I just downloaded this. This is a Halo background thing for Halo, um, but it's not, for example, 64 by 64. It is wider in uh, in one direction. So I'm going to import that and then let's see how it actually takes that. So it actually includes the entire thing. So it doesn't have to be square on all sides. It can actually be longer um, in different directions, as you can see here. This is obviously just a, a uh, an example, I don't know why you would want Halo for tutorial 1.16.2, you get the idea, okay? Um, also a thing to note is that that was a JPEG file, so we can use both PNG and JPEG. I just want to 1.12 here, I'm going to 1.12.2, I'm going to change that into, actually I'm going to take our old craft and I'm going to change that into, I'm going to add an icon, and I'm going to change that into a nether ward. Again, that is, has a transparent background. There we go, boom, it is now another ward. It is that easy, and we're done. So that is pretty much it. Again, the rest of the Multi-MC tutorial playlist is down below in the description if you wish to check it out. If you have any comments, be sure to let me know. Sorry, if you have any questions, be sure to let me know down in the comments. Hope you learned something, and I hope to see you in another video. Have a wonderful day, and goodbye. <laughs> Ding, 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 now.